how to do text box linking in Word 2011 for the Mac. So here is a typical template and when you use a template you will notice that some of the boxes have little numbers like 1, 2, and 3. That means they're linked. So how is that achieved? Well, linking means that if you double click on the box and you start typing, then the text is going to overflow on each box. So let me demonstrate that from scratch. Here I have a blank document. I'm going to click on the Home tab to reveal these selections. I am going to select the text box and I'm going to go ahead and get these crosshairs. Click and hold that draws a box. Since I need text really quick, I am going to use this short command equals rand open parentheses close parentheses and then hit the enter or your return key. What this does it creates three paragraphs with the sentence the quick brown fox jumps, jumps over the lazy dog which has all the letters of the English alphabet. Next, I want you to pay attention to this little box and this little box. They're different than these, you see? This one's clear. This one is the forward link button. And what it allows you to do is this. Click on it and you'll get another crosshair set. Click and hold and drag to make another box. Now you have two boxes that are linked together. Which, if you want to do a third box, you can also click there and make another box. So what this allows you to do is when you want to add content to the box, you double click on the box, you hit return and return and you add your own content and it automatically spills over to the other box. If you keep, keep on hitting return then it'll spill over to the third box and if the third box didn't have enough to show you then it will allow you to create yet a third box and a fourth box. There's as many linked boxes as you want. The cool part about this is that you can put this box on the third page to continue a story that you started maybe on the first page. This is particularly helpful whenever you are doing a newsletter or even a brochure. Plus, it's pretty cool to be able to link the boxes. In Word, it works a little, a little bit different. If you wish to break the link, you can always click on the box, hit delete, and now the contents on the third box are found in the second box. And if I click delete again, then the contents of the second box will show up on the first box. If you click on the first box, which has a link to the second box, you can also click on the format tab and click break link. What this will allow you to do is to create two separate text boxes and the contents of the second box unfortunately will be gone. So just clicking here break link will allow you to see this and still keep the secondary box. So again if you unlink it then that text box that you created no longer has the little number. This one doesn't have a number either. If you want to go ahead and bring back the numbers or create link boxes, again you click here and you draw the boxes that you want.